morning, YouTube. Welcome to San Francisco. This right here is going to be our Airbnb for the weekend. We're here for a little getaway mini vacation and also to visit my cousin and some friends. So, uh, yeah, uh, let's go check out the house and see what everybody else is doing. Room right here. How'd you guys sleep last night? Good. Good. Was it hot or cold? Warm in my blanket. Warm. Nice. Cold. And here is the kitchen. It's a beautiful kitchen here. Um, we used it last night already and made some dinner. And oops. And later today we're gonna go to my cousin's house and we're gonna make some Colombian breakfast. So uh, I'm definitely excited for that. All the kids are excited for that and hope you guys are as well. <laughs> where, where are the Cornos from? Uh, St. Louis. St. Louis. Yep. I was not sure. <laughs> Lady. Lady. Hi. Hi. Alright, so here we got Colombian breakfast. Mm -hmm. Arepas. And the banana. Cho chocolate. <laughs> Yeah. We got pan de bono in the oven. Excuse me, Amberly. Oh, yum. They're so fluffy. <laughs> and of course, you're not gonna miss the coffee here. <laughs> Look at this. It's beautiful. It's like a Rolls Royce of coffee making machines. And uh, I'm gonna try some. You like it? Mm-hmm. Water, soda. Like this? So you just scramble it as you cook it? Yep. <laughs> Isn't that called estrellados? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. Extra Colombian then. Yeah. I feel like we all look like we're in love right now because yeah. we're just watching the food getting cooked. <laughs> you guys look so dreamy right now. <laughs> <laughs> got an arepa with hot dogs. I mean, <laughs> we got huevo with hot dogs, an arepa, pan de bono, chocolate, no cheese inside, but that's their choice. What okay. do you think, Zach? It's really good. What do you think about that pan de bono? It's really good. It's really good, huh? Mm -hmm. It's really good. And here we go. We got a picture-ready plate for the gram. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Yum. <laughs> Let's go look at this. Are we allowed to go out here? Yeah. yeah? Oh man, you guys gotta come here. I don't see anything that looks like a San Francisco bridge. <laughs> I'm holding my glasses. Well, it's probably not I gonna think be. It's that way. Where? Okay, well then. Wow, look at this view. This view is amazing. What is the name of this park, Viviana? Square. It's All right. famous for the painted ladies, which were in lots of movies. Yeah. This is Doubtfire. Look, there's a mobile grooming right there. Yep. Mom, you gotta get one of those. Anyways. Alright. Painted ladies. 
which are famous houses that have been in shows and movies. Yep. And the one that we're gonna see right now is Full House House. The Full House Houses. The Full House Houses. All right. So here we go. Oh, this is it right here. No. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, hold on, hold on. I got too excited. This is where they filmed Full House. I think it's that one. The one with the red door. It's one of those two. It had a red door. They're not allowed to paint these houses any other color. Oh, wow. So these houses are probably 11 million each. Jeez. Another place to visit when you're in San Francisco is this place called Palace of Fine Arts. And it's just breathtaking when you first see it. You don't even realize you're in San Francisco because I've never seen this. I mean, according to some I have. So I'm gonna say I've seen this before. But look at this beautiful place. This is inspired by the great Greeks of Greece. <laughs> We're at this place called Embarcadero and uh, according to some people they got some badass grilled cheese sandwiches so we're gonna get one and share it between all of us here. A real goal here is ice cream that some people say that is some people say it's a badass ice cream place so we definitely want that. Here we have a beautiful view of the San, of the San Francisco Bridge and we're headed to Spencer Battery. It's like an old uh, fort, war point or something like that. Spencer Battery, okay? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to take some epic pictures here. So I'm pretty excited about that. And I brought my 50 millimeter. I'm not sure what lens is best for this situation. I got my 16 to 35 on the camera and my 50 millimeter in this pouch right here. I don't know, I'm not sure yet. I've never done this kind of photography, but I will try to get a good one. So here we are, we just got done taking some pictures and uh, I don't know, I'm kind of nervous. Hope they came out well. I wasn't the only one taking pictures. My cousin and my girlfriend all took pictures. So, uh, got a good variance of people. Uh, I wasn't the only one taking pictures. My cousin and my girlfriend took pictures. So, a little bit of everything. But look at this view. This view does not get, the view of the bridge does not get much better than this. All right? It's beautiful. Now, 